all right what's going on guys iridium here and today it's another exciting video because i get to show you more stuff related to act three. Oh my gosh oh my god i'm sure you guys saw the little reveal trailer where they did all the cinematics and stuff like that but today i'm literally just going to show you the first person perspective of me running through and just kind of describing all the different areas on the map on each site and just anywhere in between so without any further ado let's get right into this little walkthrough so here we're spawning in on the defending side and here's a little pull up of the map if you guys want to get some call outs down or just just pause it screenshot it whatever you need to do get those in your brain but obviously you're going to be making up your own call outs and, and stuff like that i will try to give out some call outs from what we as players in this uh, decided and just kind of were mostly using during this playthrough but for now we are currently running into the a site and both of these sites are like jungle gyms there's so much verticality on this map you're going to be having to check up and down over around every single corner on this map but there's a bunch of little tight corners here on the a site there's a couple zip lines here and the thing that sets this map apart like say haven has three maps bind has the teleporters this one site has the crazy zip line across the entire uh, a site which i will see and we'll get to as this video goes on but there's a bunch of little spots you can jump up here like these boxes i'm just kind of kzing jumping up onto so like i said always be looking up into different areas vertical wise uh when you're on this map because you never really know where someone's going to be sitting over here i'm just taking the zip line you can in fact shift on this and go slower or just go really fast and make the sound of you actually taking the zip line uh a lot of i i bet you right now you'll see a lot of people just doing drive-bys is what we call them where you just ride the zip line and just completely spray someone that might be under you and it's actually really funny definitely not practical wouldn't recommend it but it's really funny to do so as you saw at the back side of a towards the attacking side of it there's this big ramp that'll take you up into pretty much the highest point of the map where you can get a pretty good overview of the actual bomb site and the planting spot which is actually up in that little catwalk and nest that i was in which is what the map calls it you can actually plant up there as well as on the ground which is another similar thing over on the b site you can plant in this box which is like two layers to it which you'll see so this is where the attackers spawn you actually spawn in this ship and then you can kind of go uh over to the a site or through the corridors to b most people seem to lean over to the a site off of the rip it's just kind of know it's like something about the building it's like very warming and welcoming moving on this is the, actually the middle lane where a lot of fights will be happening especially if you're trying to go to b site just make it a rule to get make control if you are trying to go b just trust me you're gonna need it you will see here we're back in the defending side where there's this nice ramp that you can get a good head glitch down into mid it's a very good head glitch but it's also a very risky one if someone's on with their aim down on the other side next we're going up the stairs into the kitchen building which pretty much everyone calls this call out kitchen it's at the top of the ramp which will go down in a sec and i actually thought this part of the map is the funniest thing ever the little poster that says whoever's making snowmen stop and then there's a little no another snowman it's actually it was actually hilarious i love when riot adds that stuff but right now we're walking down uh the vent which we actually called tube you guys can call it like vent ramp whatever tube i don't know we called it tube it was just the the default call out for some reason that everyone chose and you can actually get on top of this if you're omen jet or anyone that can get up into different places which you're gonna need on this map like i said there's a lot of verticality and if you're in the kitchen area you can actually wall bang into vent it's a hard uh hard one to hit but if you know someone's coming up you can really trap them in there and going down this corridor this actually connects to the b site there are these little boxes here that remind me of the uh ivy on train if you guys are counter-strike players you know exactly what i'm talking about there's those two little boxes that you can hide behind i think it's called fridge but moving on i'm just going to cover the back side of this map the back of the defending area there's uh, a couple of these little tunnels and huts which you can actually get on top of the one i'm under right now and uh this is actually a pretty cool angle if you see some people running through the middle b connector area you can actually get a, a cheeky angle onto them running into the b site from there through that little uh through that window in the back corner of the map here we have a couple snowmen see if you can count how many snowmen are on the map once you ever get your hands on this uh they're, they're kind of everywhere here i think there's a gun buddy coming out as well with uh with all these snowmen and stuff uh moving on over to the b site though there's this big crate area where you can plant like i said on the top or the bottom which is really weird and new for planting spots i think it's usually just a flat area and without any verticality to it that you can plant on but now there's two different spots that you can plant on which actually really confuses people sometimes especially with how the sounds are in this game it's really hard to tell sometimes where the bomb is planted so more the reason to give good comms right 
So moving away from the B site into the other corner of it, I think this is actually probably one of the most important areas to control if you're holding down B site. It's uh, we call it this big yellow because of the massive yellow crate. It's a really important area to hold if you're trying to get control of that B corridor that the attackers can run through off of the spawn. It's pretty much a maze within this B area from like the middle lanes and the side lanes, which you'll see as I'm running around. There's a lot of tight corners. And like Riot said, this map is very vertical and fast paced and it really rewards snappy aim like if you're running through these corners and you see someone right next to you you're gonna want to be able to quickly snap to their face and just rip it off i think this is definitely a phantom heavy map because of how close all these angles are you're not really going to be getting that many long range fights unless you're fighting very far away on a site on higher angles or if you're fighting down middle but since this is so close quarters in most parts of the map you're going to be wanting to use the phantom in my opinion you can use whatever you want they're pretty close nowadays but i've been preferring the phantom especially because of the six skins that are coming out which i will again have a video of which will be coming out monday and finally here i'm just kind of going through all the little nooks and crannies of this maze like i was saying there's so many weird little angles you can kind of find and just crouch under and boost up on top of on top of this crate that i'm under actually you can jet boost on top of and get a really high angle like i said very vertical so do not just be looking straight ahead of you look up look down wherever you're at there's probably someone waiting there with the cheeky angle that they found so that's going to do it for my walkthrough of icebox guys i hope you enjoyed i hope you got some more info on the map and found some maybe cheeky areas that you've uh that you're looking to play i have been going through this map as a jet main and trying to find some some cheeky boosts that you can throw your ult over uh, if you guys would like a video of that make sure to let me know in the comments below as well as any other videos you'd like to see related to act three which will be coming out on tuesday I'm so excited. Hope you guys are as well. If you guys have not already, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you can be notified whenever these new videos go up, which I will be posting a bunch of them in the coming days. Today, I also posted a video going through Sky and all of her abilities and giving you guys a run through of that as well. If you're coming from that video, thank you so much for watching that. And if you have not checked that out, make sure to go to my channel and see that as well. And finally, make sure to head over to my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash Iridium, where I stream every single day except for Wednesdays and Sundays. Over there, you can catch me playing Act 3 as soon as it drops on Tuesday, as well as any other other new things that will be releasing in the coming days so thank you so much for watching today guys i will catch you in tomorrow's video which is actually going to be a full gameplay of me playing sky but with all that being said top top for now